Hello and welcome to this tutorial on the different types of surveys available in Air Magnet Survey Pro. To conduct a site survey, you will need to go to the survey area of the Air Magnet Survey Pro application. On the left hand side of the screen, I can see the adapter or adapters that I've chosen to conduct my surveys with. There are four different types of surveys that can be conducted with your wireless adapter in Air Magnet Survey Pro. A passive survey, an active survey, an active iPerf survey, and a VoFi survey. First is a passive survey. In a passive survey, the wireless network card does not associate itself with any particular AP or SSID. Instead, it simply listens to the RF data moving through the site, scanning through the channels, detecting and recording all RF signals and noises. Looking at the passive controls, I can choose which band that I would like to perform my survey on, 2.4 GHz, 5 GHz, or both bands. For my passive survey, I'm going to choose to scan all bands, and I'm also going to choose to scan for all SSIDs and APs. This table will become populated as I conduct my survey. If my adapter is compatible with all of these options, it will display the channel, MAC address, signal strength, noise level, signal to noise ratio, and SSID of the APs that I am seeing as I scan. Now let's look at an active survey. In an active survey, the wireless network card actively associates itself with a selected AP or SSID, sending and receiving RF packets to and from the AP or SSID of interest. Similar to my passive survey, I can choose which band or bands I would like to perform my active survey on. I can also choose whether or not I want to run my particular survey on a specific SSID or AP. Selecting an access point will restrict the wireless network card to associate only with that access point. Selecting an SSID will allow the wireless network card to associate to any AP within the SSID group as you roam over the site. If I am choosing to run my survey on an SSID, I can set up what roaming criteria I want to use. These criteria will be used to determine when the wireless card will elect to roam from one access point to another. I can also adjust the frame size and the delay that I want to use for my packet stream. During the survey, the associated AP status fields will populate with information about my currently connected AP, and my frame status fields will populate with data specific to the frames that I have sent. Now I am looking at active iPerf surveys. Active iPerf Survey refers to Air Magnet Survey Pro's integration with the open source iPerf software. Active iPerf Surveys allow the user to gather transmission data for both uplink and downlink rates, although it does require a bit more initial configuration to configure the iPerf server. Similar to my active survey, I can choose the band that I want to use, I can choose AP versus SSID, and I can set my roaming criteria. In addition, for an iPerf survey, I will provide information about the iPerf server and what port my traffic will be using. Any advanced iPerf configuration can be done within the advanced window. Similar to the active survey, information about my packets and my currently connected access point will be provided in the status window. A VoFi survey gathers data from an active connection between a wireless access point and a VoFi phone. In order to establish this connection, users must establish a call between two phones, one of which must be a VoFi phone. A VoFi survey is only available for users of Air Magnet Survey Pro. There are extra configuration items that must be done as part of a VoFi survey, including adding devices to Survey's VoFi phone book. For more information about VoFi surveys, please refer to the user manual. Thank you for watching, and thank you very much for choosing Air Magnet Survey Pro.